everyone and today I'm going to be doing a slightly different review. Today I'm doing it on the Omnitrix Touch which is the Ben 10 for Ben 10 Omniverse. Picture of 16 year old Ben on the front and 11 year old Ben on the back. Yeah all that information. Ta da if you want to read it, read it yourself. Or just pick it up in the shop and read it. Three modes! But I'll show you that anyway. It's on Try Me at the minute. I pulled the tab out the back. So when you buy these, make sure I, um, it's the one with a tab at the back. Or it, because then you'll just be getting fresh batteries. So I'm going to unbox this, have a go at it, and I'll tell you what I think of it. Okay, so I've had a go, tried it out, now I've got it on my wrist now. Um, so what I think, yeah, it's got a couple of mistakes though. Um, the first mistake is obviously that these bits are silver but not white, but I don't really care, they look pretty good as silver. I actually prefer it silver, but that's a mistake. Also, um, you see the sort of cross in the middle, just here? That should actually be facing the opposite direction. Because if I just show you on Bang's wrist, here, they're meant to be facing upwards, but they're a cross instead of upwards. So that's another mistake. But all hands at hand, it's pretty good. And if I just hold it there, so if you press it, that'll that is what will happen when you put it on and start it up. There is no try me mode; it's just on or off, which is just that switch there. Now, it's set on mode 1, which is speech, so I'm just going to show you all the sounds. Blocks. Dog swatch. Crash hopper. Kicking hawk. Shark squatch. Which sounds a bit excitable for us, but anyway, now on to sound effects modes, which is what you'll have on the Try Me. So we'll make this sound effect, even in the box, it'll make the sound effect, it'll go on and on and on. So it's just a try this one. So that's a sound, sound effect, they're pretty much taken from all the other Omnitrixes. And obviously these are touch buttons. So. I can't actually decide to put the camera here. So the transforming noise, I'll just put it nearer to the camera. So that's sort of from the ultimate on the tricks so. there. But it continues to flicker. So I put the camera in this. And mode 3, the secret mode where you need a plug-in to plug in here. Um, they did have the plugins at Phoenix where I got this for 25 quid. Um, but I didn't want to spend all my money on that day, so no plug-in a day. So here we go. That's the song you'll ill make. And eventually it'll make the power down sound, which is taken not directly from the original on the tricks, but from the show. So 
So yeah, um, the thing with the Omniverse Omnitrix, uh, it powers down like the original did. Now all of them powered down eventually after about 10 minutes. But this one powers down after about 2 minutes in the show. So the thing is, um, I know this panel should be the other way round because that's how it is in the show. But honestly, trust me, it's not very comfortable. I've just tried it and it's not as comfortable as this. But if I just grab the disc ultimate ultimatrix. Uh, yeah, it looks red on. And that's actually my camera. But anyway, um, is this any better than that? Yes, it is. This um, one is better than all of the Ultimatrixes that were ever released. In fact, I think the best one of the Ultimatrixes um, was the projector one because it actually worked like in the show but this one is still pretty good it's not as good as the um that's the cable for my camera because it's running out of battery um it's not as good as the ultimate omnitrix um but it is better than the original i think although the original is still really good i think it's a tad bit better because you're getting the sound effects of the original if I just clip that close there, see? And, um, you're also getting all the, some aliens to see all their things. And there's, I can tell you now, there's no way of sort of cheat, cheating in, like there was with this one, where you could just hold down one. So you couldn't just hold it. So, pretty much, unless you have a, three different blocks or something, there's no way of um, unlocking the sound effects without actually buying it. Unless you buy one and fiddle around or cut it or something. But then you probably have to buy something, otherwise you won't get the original sound. Also, um, I'm glad that they went back to these sort of straps rather than the felt ones, because... Even though the felt ones were good, it did have a problem. One, it was, it's very loose in here, so it, they're very easy to lose. So, um, pretty much we only found, I found, this is actually my brother's. Uh, he only found this scrap a couple of days ago, because he lost it for ages. <clears throat> but this, you won't lose it. The scrap. And it feels a lot more comfortable, and also, you know, it's bigger. It fits my wrist, and I'm nearly 14 now. So this one, this one uh, can fit on my wrist, but it's incredibly small. I don't know how adults can fit on it, can fit their wrist on it. Because I only can just get it on, literally. Because um, when I put it on, it's like that my wrists. So anyway, uh, thank you for watching my very first Ben 10 review, unless I've uploaded a different one. I got this on Wednesday in August, near the last Wednesday of August. Doctor Who's on on Saturday. Hip hip hooray. So, okay, we're done, we're done. Alright, alright. I'm just going to put the camera there. I'll put it down. Put the tape on the camera down. Okay. Okay. Checking it's on the right way. Okay.